Hello folks, hello. My name is Benjamin Z. Miller. I'm the managing director of a United Kingdom company called Alamo Mortgage Holdings. We offer our investors a very significant passive income that is hundreds of basis points and hundreds of pounds over what they might be able to earn with UK gilts and other government bonds. We do this by we purchase American mortgage debt, we purchase packages of mortgages, we negotiate real hard, we get a great price on a package, it lets us earn a lot of money, and as a result of that, we can also pay our bondholders a fantastic amount of passive income. In this video, we're going to talk about actively managed equity funds and how, if you really look at what they've done in Europe, they have suffered the worst underperformance in over two decades. Well, why, if that's the case, do so many people rush to shovel money at these, at these things? Why do they just insist on investing in these things? Wouldn't it make sense if it's losing so much money to try something different? You don't have to keep shoveling money, good money after bad money. You know what, folks? Take a look at our product. Alamo Mortgage Holdings, our corporate income bond, it offers a highly, highly attractive uh, alternative to these actively managed equity funds. I mean, unless you just love uh, doing things without thinking. Uh, so um, first, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more content just like this video. So, okay, folks, in the year 2022, actively managed equity funds in Europe they just got destroyed. They experienced their worst underperformance in over two decades, according to UBS analysts. European domiciled active equity funds generated an aggregate 4.13% of alpha after management fees, marking the poorest annual result since analysis began in the year 2000. Despite the volatile environment that characterized 2022, Active equity managers failed to capitalize on expected alpha opportunities. This underperformance contrasts with 2020 when alpha generation among active equity managers reached a 20-year high during a similarly volatile year. Given this backdrop, investors may find it opportune. That might be one way to describe it. Important might be another way worthwhile might be another way. Investors may want to consider alternative investments, such as corporate income bonds like those issued by Alamo Mortgage Holdings. So if you don't want to just keep getting into these things and losing money, maybe you should try something a little different this year. Maybe, maybe it's time to try something a little different. Reach out to us, folks. We can sit down and we can have a conversation. We can show you how our program works, and uh, you're going to love it. At Alamo Mortgage Holdings, we have a team of experienced professionals with a track record of success in the mortgage and the real estate industry. We also can sell you a bond that's denominated in either British pounds or U.S. dollars if you're a U.K. citizen. Our team members have cumulatively amassed over 200 years of general business experience with over 100 years in the mortgage and the real estate industry in Texas alone. Members of our team have also worked with clients including Microsoft, Chevron, Exxon, Eventbrite, and Fora Financial. As a UK company, we specialize in purchasing mortgage notes in America and offering higher returns to our investors. Please join our free weekly webinar every Thursday at 1 p.m. UK time. You can get the link by going to our website, www.alamomortgageholdings.co.uk. Just fill out the contact form. We will email you a free invitation. Or if you're on LinkedIn and it's easier, just go to LinkedIn. Look for the company Alamo Mortgage Holdings. You can follow the company. You can get the news. You can get the webinars. Uh, folks, I hope that you learn something from this video. If you learn something from this video, maybe share it with your friends. You might be able to help them also. I hope that helps and good luck with your investing.